That's right, Chuck. And uh, Brian Thompson first broke this story at the top of the hour. Now we're over the scene. As you mentioned, this is uh, Woodbridge near Seaware, a major oil leak here. Over 300,000 gallons of oil have already spilled into the Arthur Kill here from the Motiva oil facility. You can see a large facility here on the Arthur Kill. Right now we understand over 200 workers have been working throughout the day and now into this evening. Some of them out here on the Arthur Kill themselves will bring you down towards ground level again, or water level we should say. Live pictures here again from Chopper 4. A number of barges out here working in the area trying to cap off this oil spill. Again, it is storm related damage that caused this oil spill. Don't know exactly how it happened here, but obviously a lot of oil pouring into the Arthur Kill. As you know, Chopper, the Arthur Kill obviously connects Newark Bay, also New York Harbor, and of course the Raritan Bay, and it leads directly out into the Atlantic Ocean. As we swing the camera over here, it's a little bit difficult to see. That's the outer bridge crossing there to the top of your screen. If you look very closely here, it's a little bit dark out now, but right here in the middle of the screen, you can see some of these uh, the oil sheens right across here, right across in the center of your picture. A little bit difficult to see with the darkness now falling out here, but again, obviously crews have their hands full with, again, 300,000 gallons of oil have already spilt here into the Arthur Kill and again over 200 personnel here on scene right now trying to make repairs trying to cap off this oil spill and uh, obviously this is a big environmental problem here and uh, they're trying their best to get a handle on it. And reporting live aboard Chopper 4, I'm Dennis Protko, Chuck, back to you in the studio.